You're watching WMAR 2 News. I'm Randall Newsom here with your WMAR 2 News update. Well, Baltimore has seen around 13,000 vacant properties throughout the city, and now mayoral candidate Thiruv Vignaraja is talking about how he would tackle them. He went through a five-point plan that includes ending tax sales of owner-occupied properties, restarting the dollar homes program with low-interest loans, and co-investment from the city. He also wants to raise taxes on abandoned properties. These out-of-state investors and hedge funds that are just holding vacant properties because they know they're not paying anything on it, we're going to make it a little bit more expensive for them to do nothing. So they can either develop the house or sell it to someone who will. And he also plans to seize and sell dangerous properties and support developments to bring seniors back to the city. And we're taking an in-focus look now with the other candidates in the race for mayor and their plans for vacants. Former Mayor Sheila Dixon does not appear to have released a plan for addressing vacants on her website and has not publicly shared any ideas. Now, current Mayor Brandon Scott shared on his campaign website about addressing vacant homes, including investing nearly $40 million toward fighting and preventing blight and reducing the vacant housing rate. All right, let's take a look at our forecast from meteorologist Cesar Cornejo. Well, Randall, we are expecting to see a beautiful day continue for us as temperatures are expected to still be around those 70s, really, for our high temperature. Winds will be on the lighter side as well, between 5 and 10 miles an hour out of the west and really slowly shifting towards the south. You'll notice that as we head into the overnight hours as well, we get a nice little mild night as temperatures hang around those mid 40s, even a few upper 40s sprinkled around, giving us a base to work off of for a much warmer Thursday as well. Randall. Thank you, Caesar. All right, guys, stay with WMR2news.com for updates throughout the day and for news and weather while you're on the go. Download the WMR2news app in your app store. Thanks for watching. I'm Randall Newsom.